welcome back to the channel guys today i'll be taking another look at the matrix awaken unreal 5 tech demo and um as impressive as it looks i wanted to see what kind of performance the playstation 5 was actually delivering now i'm unsure about the resolution that's on the hand uh, potentially it might be some kind of dynamic resolution being used um, if I had to guess, it was it's probably 1080p upscaled, but um, this thing just looks so impressive. It has to be said. So I'm gonna use the drone to quickly have a quick look around. It's one of the best lighting models I've ever seen. And the scale of the engine as well, in terms of how tall the buildings can go. You ain't gonna want much more than that. That's very, very impressive. Anyway, I'm gonna get back to walking around and exploring the city. As we saw earlier in the Unreal Engine 5 demo, I think it was the Ancients demo, I'm not too sure what it was called. Just the close detail on the floor is pretty incredible like the resolution of pretty much all of the cracks are visible let's find a car i'm gonna walk around some of the city first have a look at a few other npcs it's a lot of motion blur so it's kind of hard to see things clear But just imagine this engine in the nearest Grand Theft Auto. This is probably what we should be expecting. And I'm not too sure when the first Unreal Engine 5 game would officially be launched. I heard that Fortnite was moving over to Unreal Engine 5, so... And that isn't scheduled to come out at all sometime in January next year, so... Maybe 2022 we might see some games. across the road there's so much going on as well and yeah some of the models don't look all that spectacular but just general generally the whole city just feels very very realistic and I would love to get this on my RTX 3090 and my 5950X and uh, my Samsung 980 Pro NVMe SSD with 7 gigabytes per second read so I've got definitely enough speed in in my IO to deal with the textures and stuff but unfortunately it's only available for PlayStation 5 Xbox One X and Xbox One S potential um, I've been told so you guys can download this demo now and give it a try yourselves very very impressive let's find a car and go for a little ride Try and find something a little bit more interesting than this mummy wagon over here. Ah, this looks okay. Try not to get myself run over. Ah, this isn't too bad. Sports car. I just want to explore the city now. Try going on the freeway or a bit less traffic. So the car handling model is not the best, but I'm not judging. Again, this is more of a tech demo than anything. Everything's quite twitchy. Just trying to push the uh, draw distance a bit and try traveling at higher speeds. Just the, the amount of stuff that's just going on here. 
It's incredible. Okay, let's pull off back into the city now. I think Cyberpunk could learn a thing or two from how to make a city feel a little bit more lifelike just by this demo alone. Now I think some things do look pretty bland in terms of textures, but in general it does look pretty impressive. So I'm looking forward to the first batch of Unreal 5 games. I'm just going to find somewhere to park and get back on, on the street. Yeah, this will do. So impressive, this whole thing. I want to know how they did this. I don't know if this is an accurate um, city to scale everything actually. If all the streets and all the blocks are actually correct to the way they laid out, or just or is this like generated automatically? I'm not too sure, but. Sure can fool me because this just feels very very accurate games like watchdog legions could learn a thing or two from this as well so yeah just looking forward to what what the future games are going to look like and it will be hard for other engines to compete with this because it's taken a long time for unreal to get to this point and um, as and with technology continuing to advance, it's only going to look better as well. Anyway, this is going to take a long time to render, so I'm going to leave it there. That's just a look at the Unreal Engine 5 Matrix Awaken uh, tech demo, and uh, it's seriously impressive. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next video.